Well, hello there, folks. <coughs> Here I am, out and about, running around. What I'm trying to do is see if I can get into a couple of remote waterfalls up here. Now, two of those, I'm not certain, but it seems like they're, they may be regulated by the U.S. Forest Service. However, when I check, I believe they're totally on county land. And the county hasn't restricted any access. So if I'm lucky, I might get into a couple waterfalls today. So I want to set this camera up on the dash. And we're going to film the trip in. There's, um, it's about, oh, another five miles to get to the first falls. And um, I do notice that occasionally there's a vehicle. So I just had a pickup truck go by. It looked like a logging outfit. So I'm not quite sure what I'm going to run into back here, but I'm going to film the way in. And I might speed that little bit of video up a little bit of music in the background zipping out there but we'll see how it goes so let's get going let's head on out there I already drove what the heck I've already driven 30 miles just to get to here now we got another five miles in here comes another pickup truck so there's some folks out here working or, or something so we'll see what we run into let's head down the road Well, I hope the camera doesn't shake too bad on this trip in, but let's see what happens. Let's get rolling.
Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And the road is getting nasty. So, throwing her into four wheel drive, and I'm going to take a peek see if I can even get in there. I might have a long ways to back out. It does not look like anybody's been driving in here for quite a while. It's telling me you ain't going any further. Yep. Yep. We get ourselves good and stuck in this stuff, so. We're gonna take a look. <laughs> I might try going just a little bit further. Nope, I'm not taking the chance. We're backing her out of here. So, I'll turn you back on once I get turned around. Now that I'm turned back around, we're gonna be heading back out of here. Um, with as much snow as what was in there, I still had about a quarter mile of road and then another quarter mile of trail to get to the falls, so a half mile through that sloppy, mucky snow mix, I've decided I'm going to try to get to the next falls I want to check out, and um, that would be Foster Falls. So I'm going to shut this down until I get on over to Foster Falls and we'll see you there. <laughs> well, we're, <laughs> we're heading in to the next falls I wanted to see if I have access to. And this road is, it's kind of mucky and soft and um, yeah, I, in fact, I'm gonna, oh yeah, yeah, I kicked her into four wheel high just to, just to make it a little easier to drive through here. Um, sorry about the camera bouncing around, I'm hand holding, um, This is the way I had it up on the dash. Oh, bumpy, bumpy. Ah. The way I had it up on the dash, it was bouncing all over the place. And, yeah. This road's not in the best, best conditions right now. It's a lot better in the summer when it's dry, but the frost is coming out of the ground and makes these roads really, really mucky. Um, it's hard to believe it's April 22nd and we still got a ton of snow. There are spots where you look off into the woods and it's solid white. Well, they were doing some logging this this winter. See, they got a lot of wood decked. They'll be coming in to haul wood out of here once this road gets solid again. That's one thing I, I, I've said it in other videos when I come in here and visit these falls because this is 
county land, not state or federal. And the county, their, their forestry department, they're excellent. I mean, these guys, they got it figured out. And they're very, very picky on their select logging. They only let the loggers come in here and do just so much. Um, they want to maintain their forests the best they can. And I'm proud of them. I think they do an excellent job here in this county. Yeah, I can. Ooh, 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 bump, bleep, bump, bump. I can tell that by the tire tracks that um, there's been there's been traffic down in here. Now I'm getting down pretty close to the river here, just about to the trailhead, and I'm gonna nose down. I think down the hill towards the river, and then I'll back back up to my favorite parking spot. We'll see. Oh no, I'm not gonna go down to the river. That's um, quite the mess down there. Quite the mess. We'll zoom in. You can take a peek. See, I'm not driving down through that stuff. The river's just down around that bend. Doesn't look like it from here, but it's a pretty steep hill. And this is my favorite parking area. It's open enough. It actually looks like the woods might be clear enough. I might take a hike into the falls, guys. But well, let's get her parked and we'll take it from there. Talk to you in a minute. Well, folks, here I am. I'm out here at Foster Falls. The road was a little, a little sloppy getting in here. I tried getting into Wren Falls. It'll be another week, maybe two, before the road's in any condition to be able to get into Wren Falls. Now I've done a lot of videos of Foster Falls, but I can't help myself. I love it out here. I just love Foster Falls. Now I've been hemmed up all winter. I got out once so far. Couldn't go far. I ran into such heavy snow I just couldn't make it. And that was a little over a week ago. Well here I am, I'm back out. I got in this far. This is my trailhead to Foster Falls. I just head on down this way. I get down there a spell and then I head to the north and I hit the river and the falls. So I'm gonna head in there. I can hear the falls from here. This time of year without foliage on the trees, sound carries better. So I can hear the falls way down there. I can also hear the wind. It's a fairly good breeze right here, but it's higher level winds and you can hear it in the top of the pines. There's a lot of big pines here, and you can hear that wind going through the tops of the pines. Hearing woodpeckers and chickadees. The woods is coming alive. It's spring. I can't believe it. April 22nd. We still got a lot of snow out here in the woods. You can see some behind me, around me. Oh well. That'll be gone in another week or so. So let's head on down to the falls and I'll do a quick little video of that. Okay? Okay, folks. We're heading down to Foster Falls. And you can see the trail conditions from last fall, the ATVs coming through here. It's a little tricky this time of year getting down to the falls. 
and I'll show you why up here in a second. Um, right there. You talk about muck. Stand in water. Lots of muck. Not easy. I either have to go way down in the woods down here to get around this, or I go up on the high end up here. I'm going up on the high end. You get into this muck, and I tell you what, there's spots in there that's so soft to go right up to your knees. The ATVers have fun in it if they want to get good and muddy. See, this stretch is nice because it's it's an old, established ATV trail. And the thing is, is it used to go all the way through. Oh, it went went a few miles off to the west, but it is now dead, it de now dead ends. There's a creek crossing. They can't get across anymore with the ATVs. Now one thing I want to do today too is keep my eyes out for shaga every time I go out, you know. I gotta keep my eye out for some shaga. And the falls are running pretty good. I can hear them real well. Now some of you may recall, last time I was out here, I was really nursing my bum ankle. I had busted my ankle up last year, last late summer been eight and a half months since that happened and my ankle right now is at least at 80 percent it's so pretty the river's at a nice level the water's flowing good I think the falls ought to be pretty we'll be there in just a moment Now I know this video is going to be a little bit long, but it is what it is. Getting into the fast water here. Been lucky. This route in isn't too bad. You don't see any snow off in the timber here. But every once in a while, there's a patch. Doesn't surprise me. Still pretty cold out. There we are at the very top. Sun's trying to come out, which is nice. Let's see, I'm gonna work my way down here. Try to find the best route to get down on the rocks, looking out over the falls. 
that's one thing I have learned. I love waterfalls, but I don't like to fall. They are running pretty good. We'll get some good shots of them lower, farther down here. They're flowing really good, really good. There's a lot of water coming out over the rock here. That's usually dry throughout the summer. This spot is usually dry. I've seen it, I've seen it flow a lot harder than this. But, this is flowing good, flowing really good. We're gonna take a walk down here towards the base. in there you can see that nice step falls it's beautiful back in there it's a beautiful day beautiful day the sun's coming out the clouds are breaking up Again, this is a waterfall that I could spend all day at. We're not going to today. We're going to be moseying on. I want to cover a bunch of territory today.
Well, folks, I'm going to see you back at the truck. I hope you enjoyed this little hike down to Foster Falls. It's the first waterfall of the year, folks. So let's make 2020 a great year, even with all of this stay, in, stay at home business. Stay in about to stay at home. I'm going to get out here one way or the other. So I'll see you all at the truck. Well, there you have it, folks. That was fun. Nice couple hours of hanging out at a waterfall, hiking around a bit. I wandered off a bit off in the woods over here. There's a nice big hill over here that's got like a stone outcrop on it. I went up to the top of that and sat for a while. And by golly, it's time to get down the road. I got a few other places I want to explore today, so I know this video was a little long, but you know, Stye can't help himself. I let that camera run and run and run, and I don't know what to cut, what not to cut, so hopefully it wasn't too long for you, and hey, let, that, let, let your adventures be real. Get out there, enjoy yourselves. I didn't see a single soul today in all my hiking, so yeah, we're batting 100 today. Hey, until the next time, get outside, get some fresh air, take in the outdoors. Sty loves you all. Hey, I want you to get out there and take care. Stay outside, stay safe, until Sty sees you again. You all have a very, very nice day. Bye-bye.